welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate it. Today I'm going to show you guys the easiest way to put in an EMT pipe connector into any type of box. This is just a uh, four square box extension. Um, but some people might put this on um, afterwards, like put this on their pipe and then put it on the box. But it's always going to be easier to put it on the box first. If you're dealing with anything live, make sure it's dead. This is already dead. Um, so anyways, the, the easiest thing is going to be to simply put it into the box and then loosely tighten down the lock nut. Sometimes they're tricky, but it does help if you just kind of screw it in and then you can uh, get going from there. But um, what I like to do is uh, put the lock nut on the bottom pretty tight, um, pretty snug, and then I like to leave uh, leave the connector a little bit like 90 degrees off or maybe even like a 45 to 80 degree. Uh, so anyways, you're gonna leave that snug like such. And then what you're gonna wanna do is simply take your channel locks and then you're gonna do that final turn. I kinda like to hold the lock nut on the bottom because sometimes it'll spin. So hold your lock nut on the bottom, take your channel locks and then simply line it up straight like that. That one was a little bit loose. As you can see, I can probably still twist that. So I'm gonna do it again. So hold that on the bottom. And then sometimes you have to do this a couple times. Um, and if you do need to do it a couple times, what you do is simply just back it out, twist the lock nut a little bit more, and then tighten it down again. And that should get you right where you need to go. As you can see, twisted the lock nut. And now it's gonna be nice and firm into place and it's not really gonna be going anywhere. So always line up your screws straight in front of you, depending on the circumstance. If you're doing it in the ceiling or something like that, if you're just um, doing pipe, pipe, if you're doing pipe couplings or something like that, maybe you'll be pointing them up in the ceiling or down in the ceiling. If you're doing back to back, maybe one up, one down. But for the most part, you're gonna always gonna be wanting to put your screws straight forward unless it's going behind sheetrock or something and you have to turn it sideways so the screws don't hit the back of the sheetrock. But for the most part, like I said, 80% of the time, you're gonna be wanting to put the screws straight out in front of you. So that's the easiest way to do it is with a pair of channel locks, kind of leave it off, like I said, a little bit off to the side and then do that last turn nice and tight and straight. So hopefully this will help you out if you're new to the electrical trade. Anyways, thanks for watching, I appreciate it. As always, if you enjoyed, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. Help out the channel. And I'd love to see you guys back in the next video. God bless. See you in the next one. Peace.